Good morning from Da Nang Beach here in Da Nang, Vietnam. It is the fifth largest city in Vietnam, but to me, this area right here feels like a beach town. Not just a beach town, but one of the coolest beach towns in all of Vietnam, if not Asia. So let's head on down to the beach. Good morning. Where we're going to see, hello, hello. Where we're going to see, America. Okay. Yeah. Where we're going to see hundreds of people taking a morning swim. And this is before the sun even comes up. So they come here on their mopeds. They take their morning swim. Then they have these outdoor showers and pools and lockers. But let's go check this beach scene out and watch a sunrise. And it's a beautiful sandy beach. And look at this. Hundreds, if not thousands of people waiting for the sun to come up, getting in the water, running, stretching. And there you can see a little glimpse of the city. What a wonderful way to start a day. The water feels great. All right, we're getting our first glimpse of the sun over there, peeking up above the mist. We have a man doing his morning push-ups. And check this out. Look how many people are in the water over here. Just enjoying the sunrise from the ocean. And let's head on back up to the promenade. Check out a little of that scene. Let's wait for a little bucket. Crazy scene, but my feet are clean. Let's uh, head on back to the main promenade and we'll check out the people doing their morning exercises. And we are on the promenade that parallels this main beach road here in Da Nang. And up here, we're gonna see some synchronized dancing, which is a very, very popular form of exercise here in Vietnam. And you're gonna see this in every city you go to. These ladies, good morning. Get up every morning and get their exercise in. <laughs> Just get up, you get the blood flowing. Good morning, how are you? Get the blood flowing, get that day started. And behind me, we have people using these built-in exercise machines here on the promenade. This direction, we have more synchronized dancing by these lovely ladies. And there's a wedding happening on the beach right now, so let's head on down there. And how great is that? A nice sunrise wedding here on the beach in Vietnam. And getting their lovely wedding photos. Beautiful, beautiful bride. And behind her, someone's catching a nice wave on their longboard. And right here, you can see we have a little river coming out from the city creating a jetty. So there's a lot of surfing peaks in this area. Good morning. And we have a gentleman getting ready to paddle out, get some waves. <laughs> get some small waves today. This guy's ready to get out there too on his 20, which is an awesome looking board, warming up behind me. And I do love this board. Got some retro style here in Vietnam. It's a great board, man. Yeah, I love it. As the sun gets higher in the sky, I don't think the camera's gonna pick it up. 
but very, very rideable waves coming in on this jetty right here. Fun, fun little waves. And when I got here, the waves were significantly bigger. Probably a good one to two feet overhead. Clean, it's glassy every morning, typical. And uh, gets a little choppy in the afternoon. But people stay out all day. It's a very, very active community here in Da Nang. The beach is crowd crowded at all times. The promenade's crowded at all times. At night, all the bars lining this area, all the beaches, beach chairs and umbrellas are full of people enjoying a nice cocktail, beer as the sun sets. And here we have some lovely ladies getting some nice morning pictures in front of the surf with the sun coming up. And over here, Drip Sandcastle. Wow, look at this. That looks awesome. Here we have the long border. Getting ready to go out. Yeah, no, it looks decent down there. Yeah, right here I noticed some peaks with no one on it, yeah, right? You know, there's a couple guys over there on board, but it's so small and soft, but it's okay. I'm here. Do you, do you have waves here most of the year? Uh, I'm just visiting. Okay. So the guy was telling me, um, usually up late October and November typhoon season, they do come periodically, but it's really all the way to May next year. Wow. Yeah, so we'll, we'll yeah. see. I've been here three days and it's been good every day. Yeah, but it's kind of small. Suppose tomorrow may be better. Nice. Okay, have a good one. Okay. Well, there you have it. Typhoon season, which we're in. I might have to put this on my surf destination list. I haven't been out yet, but um, if it picks up tomorrow, I think that might be the day for me. There's plenty of board rental here in the city. Really just perfect, perfect peeling longboard waves as the sun comes up. Now, Da Nang is also a great jumping off point to explore the area. You have the old city of Hoi An nearby. You have the Ba Ha Hills. I believe that's what they're called. You have numerous bridges. You have the Dragon Bridge, which breathes fire on the weekends at 9 p.m., which I missed. I didn't find out till this morning. And then, of course, you have all these hills and coastline for hiking, all within easy reach of the Nang Beach. But this would make a lovely home base. We see more and more people posing for their sunrise pics and stretching. And up here, we have one of those boats that look like a bowl. And it seems to have fishing nets and buoys and ropes. These men are getting ready to head on out, do some fishing. It's also the type of boat the lifeguards are using to propul patrol the beaches. And I'm staying with my friends in an apartment right there, that tall tower, the white tower in the middle. They're running a two bedroom, two bath apartment on the ninth floor with an amazing view, fully furnished, very update, updated for I believe 700 a month. So, Rentals are very, very affordable here. It's a lovely, lovely place to spend the winter. And these men over here are playing volleyball, but no hands. And the skill is incredible. Oh, 
Look at this. Crazy. Incredibly impressive. The athleticism is amazing. This is going on forever. Very impressive. What an amazing round round that was. The skill. Wow. That was a crazy shot. Coming at me. Oh, ho, ho. we have another area with dozens of swimmers and another bathtub boat patrolling the water. You'll also notice that the beachwear is very modest here in Vietnam. The people get in their photos with the beautiful morning light. And here we have hundreds of people in the water in this section. have a lifeguard setting up the swimming area for the day. It's, uh, they're very strict on what areas you can swim in. If you cross that line, you'll hear a whistle and they'll wave you right back into it. And here we have a lifeguard boat because everyone's wearing these little buoys too. I guess, good morning. And check this out. He's got a little chair, one paddle, a life ring, ready to get things done if need be. Save a life. These guys doing their morning stretches, getting it done. Good morning. Looking good, brother. Good morning. How could you not have a great attitude by starting your day here, watching the sunrise on Da Nang Beach? One of the coolest beaches in all of Asia, easily. And it just goes on and on and on. As far as you can see around those buildings, around that point, people starting their day, enjoying the beach. Let's go back up to the promenade and head back that way. Shops opening up. You can get a pizza, fruity drinks, beer on draft. It's all kinds of morning treats. Have some morning karaoke. Fun. The beach is just getting more and more crowded as the sun comes up here. And as I make my way back to the apartment, you can see the Nang Beach is a nice, chill, but very active community. And if that's what you're looking for, in a vacation destination or 
even a, even a retirement destination. It's a, not a bad place. You could do much worse. The meals are extremely affordable. Most entrees under $5. Beer, very affordable. And of course, housing, wow. You can get some crazy deals here. And the people are friendly, the city's safe, the city's clean, has anything and everything you can possibly want. It's the fastest Wi-Fi I've ever seen in my life. Videos that usually take me an hour and a half, two hours to upload, 10, 15 minutes here. And uh, just about everywhere, every restaurant has Wi-Fi. They're actually known for that. And uh, yeah, Da Nang Beach, Da Nang, Vietnam. Highly recommend. Ciao.